What's going on, combat sports fans? We just had a potential fight of the night with Suna Davis' daughter versus Mallory Martin at Invicta FC 22. And this is my commentary on it. Welcome to Joe's Commentary and Predictions. If you're new to the channel and you enjoy combat sports and you like a little twist to it, Punch that subscribe button into submission down below and share the video with your family and friends. Now, this was very entertaining. I actually had the fight score differently than the judges. The judges all gave it to a Dave, uh, Suna Davis' daughter. She won unanimous decision 30-27, 29-28, 29-28. I actually had it 29-28 for Mallory Martin. I like both of these fighters, the way they both look. They're both beautiful. They're both awesome. They're both badass octagon warriors. These two women went to war, and they showed us that they are true soldiers inside of the cage in MMA when it comes to Invicta FC. And, uh, you know, where um, I'm curious to see where else these two women have fought and what else their background is. I'm going to be researching these two because they are definitely badass and legit warriors in the strawweight division at 115. Now Mallory is 23 years old, 5 foot 4, and she is now 1-1 one one with her Invicta FC debut with losing to Son of Davis' daughter. And uh, Davis' daughter is 31 years old, 5 foot 3, just an inch shorter than Mallory, and she came in at 115. Point eight, and she it was one and zero before this, so now she goes to two and zero. She's perfect still. I really want to see Mallory Martin come back and fight again in Invicta FC if the UFC doesn't snatch her up first. And the same with Davis' daughter. She's a badass too. I'm really looking forward to seeing who she ends up fighting next. Will these two women both end up being on the same card and fighting? and fighting different competitors in the future. They both punched each other a lot. Um, Mallory had two black eyes at the end of it, and uh, Davis' daughter, she had cuts on her face and bloody and smashed up and whatnot. Uh, they both, uh, David, uh, Mallory took down uh, Davis' daughter a few times and whatnot. And in the third round, uh, Davis' daughter ended up getting the back of uh, Mallory Martin, and it looked like she might get her in a submission, but Mallory kept her legs propped up and her hands up and she kept on trying to pull her off and eventually she ended up getting up and getting her off and standing up and they boxed and fought some more and it was an extremely entertaining and awesome fight if you uh, aren't able to watch this tonight on the UFC Fight Pass I recommend you get it uh, hopefully the UFC ends up I mean uh, Invicta FC ends up putting this out in the future as a free fight on their uh, YouTube page if you're not subscribed to Invicta FC go over and uh, subscribe to Invicta FC's YouTube page it's definitely well worth it and they have awesome videos over there uh, you know so uh, Davis' daughter wins over Martin, and I was extremely looking forward to this fight, and it was really awesome, really well fought by both of these women. They showed they both have iron shins uh, when it comes to the two of them fighting each other, and that they get the heart of warriors like big-ass lions and whatnot. So if you enjoyed this video, let me know down below in the comment section your thoughts, opinions, good or bad. Slap the like button if you enjoyed this video and you liked it, the Davis Daughter one. Slap the like button for her winning. If you're a fan and you like Mallory, mine, slap the like button for her as well. And, and and punch that subscribe button into submission the subscribe button will be popping up over here there'll be some other videos over here if they look interesting peep those out share the video with your family and friends thanks for watching combat sports is awesome and you guys are amazing